Welcome back Serial Eaters to another edition of What's in the Box. So what have we got this time? Well this is from 1990 and it's Shreddy's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Action Stickers and Transfers. Let's take a look. So on the front of this packet you'll see a picture of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. It's interesting actually the branding wise that uh, they use that because I think on the TV program at the time they had to refer to them as Teenage Mutant Hero Turtles. So uh, there was some issue I think but uh, anyway they clearly got the proper title right for this. And then you've got these uh, two Shreddies characters that uh, replace the crows that they'd used previously. On the side you've got this send away for this awesome glow in the dark poster. And uh, you could use that poster with some of the transfers and stickers that uh, you got. So uh, I'll show you that in a moment. And then on the back, you've got this really colourful uh, scene, background scene to actually use your transfers with. So uh, in this case, it's called uh, the New York rooftop scene. So there were four of these to collect and I'll, uh, I'll show you those in a moment. So uh, and there was also instructions about how to use the the actual transfers as well, albeit it's probably pretty obvious. So that was the uh, New York rooftop scene. You've then got this one, which is titled Face to Face in the Antique Shop. You've got uh, this one, which is the uh, Dude's Southside Den. And finally, you've got this one, which is open combat in New York City. So uh, that was the four scenes to collect. So uh, let's just clear those away. So when you open the packet, this is what you actually got. So there were six of these uh, cards to collect. And on one side, you've got uh, this uh, image. So in this case, you've got uh, Master Splinter. And then on the back, You've got these uh, letter set transfers where you've got this sort of protective film uh, to look after them. But the intention is obviously you can rub them down on the scene on the back there or on that poster. So there were six, as I mentioned, there was one there, which is Splinter. You've got Shredder. And I'm going to try and get these turtles right. So uh, I think the blue mask is Leonardo. You've got uh, Michelangelo. He's wearing the orange. You've got uh, Raphael that's wearing the red. And then finally, you've got Donatella who's wearing the uh, purple. So, and on each of these, as I mentioned, you've got uh, different letter set transfers of various characters to, uh, to actually use or scenes or words or whatever. So really nice those. So let's actually have a look at uh, what some of these lecture sets look like when you actually rub them down. So I've got uh, a spare set here. So here's the sh shredder one. So you'll see there's a sticker which we can put on there. And then you've got the transfers. Which you can actually now see through. I'd never realised that, but you can actually see what they look like through the actual plastic. So, all the thin card. So, if we rub those down, hopefully, it reveals the character. bits of it but I don't know if because of uh, how long I've had these it's a bit of a problem but I'm having to rub quite hard now there we go oh fantastic oh except we've lost a bit a bit of his uh, bit of his body let's rub that on there we go let me rub that down now we've got one of the turtles. So this looks like one of the bad guys. One of the ninjas that they used to go and attack. Let's 
almost. Oh, this is hard work. Maybe I won't go through them all then. <laughs> there we go. All we can do is his saying as well at the top here, his little speech bubble. Unfortunately, some of it's actually come out against the baddie that I've just gone and rubbed down, but there you go. Hey dudes. I'll have one of the other turtles coming out of his manhole. Oh. As a kid, I don't remember having to rub down this hard for any of these uh, these Letraset transfers. There we go, that's worked all right. Give that a quick rub. And then finally we'll have Master Splinter in here as well. There we go. So uh, really nice transfers these actually. Let's uh, zoom in so you can see them all properly. So uh, not bad, I didn't quite get the the speech bubble right but you can see how you could then interact those onto the background scenes and get a really good effect now i'm not proposing to do this for all of them and you have to watch me rub every single one down so after much rubbing you've uh, already seen the one with uh, shredder here's the splinter version so again you'll see that uh, splinter actually on this one and also this one look very similar uh, and the good thing is you could actually sort of interact some of the pieces. So I've got him throwing that piece of uh, uh, piece of pizza. Here are the other ones. So uh, one of the problems with these is that it was an absolute nightmare rubbing some of them down. So you can see that in some cases like this bit here, that's a bit of uh, one of these turtles feet that I got caught down. So I've thrown him kicking a bit of pizza to just cover a multitude of sins. Here's another one as well. This chap lost his foot, so I thought I'd put the skateboard in front of it. I don't know whether it's because of the age or just because of the fact that uh, they were just very hard to rub down. So uh, these sort of Letra set transfers, uh, I always thought were quite easy, but um, who knows? And actually, I use the word Letra set. They might not actually be Letra set. They, uh, they, they probably weren't at this time because I think uh, Letra set had actually gone bust by then. So it's action transfers or somebody like that but uh, like I say I'm not an expert on it and here's the final one that I've got which uh, you can obviously see again parts of it didn't quite rub down okay but uh, they're still really really nice transfers and actually when you put them on the packet I'm sure they looked really good or bit must have been a bit odd with uh, some of them because they already had some of the turtles pre-printed on so uh, I guess you didn't want to duplicate that so I've only got five of these spare to actually rub down. So the sixth one, which is this one here, uh, you can see again, it's got similar characters like uh, Shredder and a couple of the turtles. And uh, whatever that thing is, the mutagen. Anyway, uh, one thing actually, you might just see around the outsides of here. I did see that the... the the sort of transfer had a slight coloration so i thought that they might glow as well but uh, they don't it's um it's actually these transfers themselves so this is what they look like before and here's an image of what they look like after so you can see that the uh, outline's got this sort of glow in the dark effect so really nice set this hugely collectible and obviously the uh, ninja turtles have managed to go through several sort of iterations over the last few decades but a uh, great set It's a bit early to be doing homework, isn't it? That's not homework. It's those teenage mutant turtle thingies. Where did they come from? From his shreddy's pack. I love being a turtle! Oh. If you're interested in this and other cereal offers, then please subscribe to this channel, like and share the links, or visit my website cerealoffers.com, click on Cereal Partners, and then Shreddies.